Like us, animals do eat different kinds of food. Look at the picture. The giraffe is eating leaves. Lion has already killed some animal and is enjoying his royal meal now. The bear is holding fish in its mouth. And what is this? The bear is eating plants here. Like bear, some animals eat both plants and other animals too. Let us now see these small animals or insects. There are some very small but harmful insects. They cause diseases. We all know that disease malaria is caused by the biting of mosquitoes. They suck our blood. Similarly, flea, louse and tick also suck blood of other animals. Let's see how. As we can see, a louse is seen on the human head. It sucks blood living there. Aman, do you remember when you were lost in the jungle, how you and Anand were laughing on seeing the monkeys taking out lice from each other's head? Louse is such type of an animal which not only lives on the animal body but also feeds on it. Strange but true. Some animals live inside the body of other animals. These are also harmful and cause various diseases. So how do they get food? These worms like tapeworm, roundworm and threadworm live in the body of other animals in the intestine. They feed on the digested food inside the body of host animal. Life is so convenient for them as they don't have to cook food or even search for it. It is the host who has to suffer because of it. So, if we sum up the various food habits of animals, animals that eat plants only are called as herbivores. Herb means small plants. So, herbivores are plant-eating animals. Flesh or meat-eating animals only are called as carnivores. Carn means flesh, hence carnivores are flesh-eating animals. Animals which eat both the plants and other animals are called as omnivores. Omni means all, so Omnivores eat all plants and meat too. Animals that live in or outside other animals' bodies and feed on them are called as parasites. Based on the food habits, animals can be divided into four groups. Herbivores, that is plant eating, carnivores, that is meat or flesh eating, omnivores that is both plant and meat eating animals, parasite which lives in and on other animals and feeds on them. Let us now classify these animals based on their food habits. A leopard is a meat eater, hence it is a carnivorous animal. The zebra eats plants only. It is a herbivorous animal. The mosquito is a parasite as it feeds on other animals. How about crow? I think Aman should know this well. Aman, during your visit to your grandparents' place, didn't the crow snatch and eat the bread first? Then later, it was carrying a dead mouse while you were crossing the river? The crow eats both the plants and other small animals, insects too, so it is an omnivorous animal.